What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. Today I have a first impressions from the house of Profundum Roma. This one is called Arso. And uh, you know, lucky sin, I ain't even gonna say anything about them because you know how much I hate them. But there you go, Arso. Comes in a dabber bottle, so I had to transfer it into my own handy dandy decant bottle. And we just gonna go straight to skin with this one, guys. So I'm gonna give you my first impressions on this uh, fragrance. And uh, let's go ahead, hop into the notes, and then we'll jump back out. I'll spray down some skin. All right, guys. So, Arso by Profundum Roma is an EDP. It was a 2010 release. And uh, Arso, for everybody who doesn't know, you guys probably know, but it means burned. Um, every time I think of Arso, I think of arson. And uh, I remember how I was just a little arson uh, growing up. I love to play with fire. So the notes for this fragrance is cedar leaves, incense, leather, and pine resin. I got these notes directly from their website. And uh, let's go ahead, spray down some uh, skin, guys. Let's get this first impression going. If you hear any boom boom outside, it's because it's the 4th of July today and um, people are going crazy. So. Wow. <laughs> okay, I'm getting like the cedar. Uh, it's the cedar leaves, of course. So it's like a um, resiny cedar leaf type of deal. Hmm, it's kind of sweet a little bit, and I'm assuming it's because uh, that resin. Uh, it's very resinous. E. It's very sweet. Uh, I was thinking it was gonna be. I was thinking it, it was gonna smell like uh kind of like burnt firewood but uh, i'm kind of mistaken here let, let me see it might change though mm. this smells like you stick your nose straight up to a cedar tree that bark or just like the leaves themselves and you just take a big whiff it almost reminds me of um marcus de sod El by eldo and I'll put a picture up here. It's, I did a uh, review or a first impressions on it. I actually have the full bottle. This kind of reminds me of that fragrance, um, but this one is just a little bit more realistic. Uh, I can tell that the ingredients that they used in this are very, very top-notch high quality. Um, I'm thinking this brand is a, it's a niche brand for sure, because when I was looking online, a 100 ml will go for on Lucky Scent, 275 USD, which is quite expensive, but this seems to be fairly linear. Uh, I can get a little bit of that incense in there. However, it's it's more of like a mild incense. It's not super smoky. Uh, it's very cedarish though. It's very cedar bark. That's kind of what I'm getting, like maybe like a wet cedar. It's very dry too. And I know I just said wet cedar, but this is kind of, um, it's kind of fairly dry. We have a um, mountain, uh, here in Las Vegas, it's called Mount Charleston. And when you walk up there, it's about 20 degrees cooler, uh, up there than it is down here, uh, down here. And so when you make your way up there, uh, all of these, uh, you know, cedar leaves and, 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 and pine needles and, and stuff like that. I think I said pine, uh, in the beginning, but it, it really does kind of smell like pine. Um, but you have, all those trees and you can stick your nose up to that bark and uh, we call them a uh, neapolitan bark because it, it smells like kind of like neapolitan ice cream but it's a little woody this is what this smells like it, it almost kind of uh, smells like a um a bomb almost like um if i can remember i can't remember the word but I will put a picture up here, and this is exactly what this smells like, like like Tiger Bomb, kind of. Uh, I, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Tiger Bomb before, but this is kind of what this is reminding me of. Very realistic cedar, piney, resiny. Obviously, you have that pine resin. Yeah, that's what it is, that pine resin. You have that pine resin. Uh, I'm not getting any leather, but it could it, it could um, make itself uh, present uh, later on in the dry down. Uh, this is very oily. I don't know if you guys can see the sheen, 
but um, very, very high oil concentration, I can already tell. And it should be if you're paying uh, 120, you know, or, or $275 for 100 ml for a bottle. Pretty linear though. Uh, I'm kind of just getting just a slight, a slight sweetness. Um, it's not a vanilla, vanilla sweet. It's not a tonka bean sweet. I just think it's, like I said, uh, we have, uh, and I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure if it's the pine note or if it's the cedar leaves. I'm not too sure, or the, uh, yeah, the pine resin or the cedar leaves. I'm not too sure which one of those are given off that uh, kind of um, sweet bark, but it, it, it smells like sweet bark to me. Um, and that, like I said, it reminds me of Mount Charleston and you go up there in these huge trees and uh, you can peel the bark off and they're kind of like uh, jigsaw bark because you know, you, you peel it off and uh, you know, there's re it's resiny, you know, it's sticky, you get that sticky resin from it. And if you stick your nose right up to that bark, this is what this reminds me of. Um, it is actually really amazing quite linear though. It's not jumping off my skin, um, but I can, I could smell it from here. Um, but, um, I like it guys. It kind of, it, it's kind of giving me pine saw vibes, but it's it, it, take the cleaning aspect away from pine saw, take that chemically chemical pine solly smell away. And this is what you get. Um, but yeah, guys, this is my, this is my first impression of Arso by Profumum aroma. Uh, I hope you guys like this first impressions. If you did, if you've tried this one before, let me know, let me know down below uh, what you guys think. If uh, you know you want to get your nose on it, let me think and uh, let me know. And um, what is your scent of the day today? My scent of the day today is uh, Alexandria from Alexandria Perfumes. It is called Crazy Pineapple. Um, I'm actually starting to come around to this fragrance just a little bit more and uh, Word all day and uh, you know 10 sprays but worked fantastic thank you guys all for watching this channel thank you for watching Loxins. i'm your boy dr goo i'll see you in my next video and uh, stay safe enjoy life guys all right see you